Oh, welcome, folks, to the Redneck Review of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And I'm going to tell you, folks, this movie, I, I, I don't know what to say all about this, but let me tell you, but the movie was all right. It was. It, it it had its twist and turns and and changed some things about the turtles' origins. Action was good, but there's some problems in here. Well, first of all, we're going to take Leonardo. Now, Leonardo is the leader of the Turtles. But, uh, let me tell you. When he act like a cowboy, there are problems. Now, the turtles are still, they just look weird. I can't tell you, I've never seen the weirdest turtles I've ever seen in my life. But, uh, let me tell you, uh, Raphael, he was just like a turtle with steroids. And, uh, Donald Till, he was, uh, he was a nerd. We all knew that. You know, he, they did a little changing on him. Made him wear some glasses. Look a little nerdier than normal. We, we we could deal with that. And, uh, but the biggest change they made was Leonardo. I mean, not Leonardo. Michelangelo. <laughs> oh, we all know Michelangelo was being a, a surfer. Beach bum kind of guy, but this guy in this turtle movie was a gangster. Now, tell me, folks, have you ever seen a you ever heard of gangsters say cowabunga or anything, anything like a surf, like a surfer would do? No, sirree. Well, I tell you, the next person I I have to see it's about Hollywood's whore, <laughs> Megan Fox. Let me tell you now, the first part of the movie. She was all right. She acted April's part. But, uh, you know, when you're watching a PG-13 movie, you expect it to be PG. But, no. 
We had to see her ass. Of course. You know, that's just a typical movie. With her in it. Now, uh... Like I said, she did good at the first part. But, you know, you would think most people, most movie, movie sorry, most movies, But, uh, you figure, you know, like, you know, we, I, I imagine her being part of the beginning of the move, movie, being the main actress. And, you know, you figure, you know, once the turtle got involved, it was... They'd be, you know, concentrate on the turtles. But no, that's not the story. They had a, they had a, you know, bring sex in it. You know. And, uh, you know, folks, this, this movie was just plain stupid. You know, you, you, you changed the origin of how the turtles were created and who was all involved. It's like, you know, uh, they're not really, uh, turtles anymore, you know, they're like, uh, some lab animals, you know, they, you know, just, you know, how they learn jiu-jitsu and, or ninjutsu, they learned it from a crazy book. But, uh, if I was to rate this movie, <laughs> I'd say it's, uh, <laughs> three chickens and two ducks. It's, <laughs> Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's my review. I'm Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The movie's not worth watching. I would wait for it to come out to a red box or something. <laughs> or if you got Netflix, maybe it'll come out for a <laughs> free stream. <laughs> But uh, it it definitely I would rather watch Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle three 
before I watch that movie again. Well, good day, folks, and have a nice night.